related to Santa Claus? <laughs> no, silly. Not Santa Claus. Stanislaus. He was your great-grandfather's grandfather. And he was the most powerful of all the Cassidines, just as bloodthirsty and cutthroat as he was a rebel. And you know that Stanislaus tripled our family power base? That was before meeting with a most unfortunate and untimely demise. And do you know how he used to pay back his most hated enemies for their crimes? No. He would chop their heads clean off. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Oh, Nicholas, please. Such language in front of your young, impressionable son. Spencer, your grandmother likes to tell a lot of silly stories. Just remember, they're just stories, okay? Now, there's absolutely no reason why we can't teach Spencer about our family's history. Well, he should revel in it, as will your newest child. I think it's time for another trip to the park. What do you say, buddy? Let's go. All right, let's go. Ms. Cassadine, yes. I was able to locate the item you requested. Oh, excellent. Thank uh, you. Another assistant, Grandmother? Uh, I'm sorry. This is Thor, Thor, one of the most talented manservants it's been my pleasure to have. It, oh. No. I have plenty of staff on the property. I really have no need for another whatever. Indeed, that's is. nonsense. Thor will be working directly with me as I require a more personal touch. Now, I need you to take care of that other matter we discussed. Consider it done. Now, this is something for you. Why don't you put it over there? It's a little something that's been handed down in our family for many generations. It's a little piece of history. All right. Cool. All right. We're going to take a look at this later, okay? Right now, I want you to go upstairs, grab all your toys so we can take them to the park, okay? One. Well, you would have preferred that I gifted our young Cassidine with a... He's not... Choo-choo. He's not yours. He's mine. He's nowhere near old enough for something like this. You know, it's so disappointing to see how bourgeois you have become. Our family is rich in tradition. And if you want to make Spencer into an appropriate heir, then you have to pass the traditions on to him. If you expect, and to your newest child. If you expect to stay here, you're going to have to live by my rules. Don't give my son knives or daggers or any other dangerous objects for that matter and violent tales of our family's history are not welcome he's just a child he is a cassadine heir. he's my son and i'll raise him my way and i won't put up with any inappropriate behavior between you and your goon or whatever he is in this house and the last rule elizabeth will have her own say in how this new baby is raised hello are you coming to the park too why yes grammy hello why don't you join us you and Spencer can play in the sandbox and enjoy a delicious corn dog together. Grammy Heller will take you out for a more suitable activity sometime soon. Yeah. Okay. We'll see about that. I think we're ready. Let's do it. Come on. Has the task we discussed been handled? Our friend, the lab technician, has met with the most unfortunate accident. Oh, excellent. Now, no one will ever know that Elizabeth's child is really a Spencer.